Hi my friends, welcome to the channel. In this video I'm going to show you how to do a quick tune-up on your old Chevy small block. In our situation this is a 1964 Impala. Uh, so uh, in previous videos I showed you how to do spark plugs on it, which is fairly simple. In this video we're just going to uh, replace the uh, distributor cup and rotor. So you don't need much for that, you just need some screwdriver. Actually it's a flathead on ours, so press it press and move and there is a little like a clippy thingy that will pop up I don't know what to call it, it's like L shaped the side by the coil is kind of a pain but we'll get there Alright, and yes, you are seeing correct. I'm not unplugging any wires right now. There's a reason for it. It's the easiest way to plug it all back in to the new cap. Because you just plug it in exactly the same way as you unplugged it. So that will make it a lot easier. But we're also... Alright, so now, let's see if we can get to our rotor. And it should be fairly gentle here. Nothing needs to be torqued crazy here. It's not bad. I mean, it's a little worn out. We can get to it. It's not bad. But might as well replace it. Tune up is a tune up, right? We can do the, everything all we can to make this bad boy run better. You don't want to over tighten it, just snug. Because remember, you're the one that's going to probably be taken off. Alright, so that is done. And now, so see where the metal bracket is? So we're kind of going to go from the metal bracket to make sure that we got everything. So the center one is actually our main coil one. So we're just going to take that off for now. And now, we're just going to do one by one over here. Boom. So this one will go right here. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to put die grease on all of it. Anything that will help the contact is a good thing. Some people don't use this. I like to use degrees. 
the way I look at it, can't hurt. Alright, so we got this one out of this guy, so we're gonna put this guy in here. One. They're actually not actual numbers of cylinders, I'm just same numbers of wires. I'm not talking about fire and mortar here. Uh. Got them all except the ignition one. No, uh -huh. gotta actually put those guys back out so we can put it in the proper position. One side. Now we got the more difficult side over here. Good, good, good. Now since it's on, make sure that all the plugs are good. Get this guy over here. Make sure we'll put some grease in there. Actually, we already did, never mind. Mm. 
And that's about it. That's how you do flat spark uh, cap and rotor in older mus older muscle car. Hey guys, if you like my video, please hit subscribe and hit like if you can. Part that we used in this video is Duralist Gold.